Hi, my name is Noldine Poitvien. This is a presentation for class 602 with Professor Levy. Today I will be doing a presentation teaching children with visual impairment to read simple words. I will present several items to the child one at a time with label of the items. For example, today we have apples, grapes, pomegranate, grapefruits, a bird, and a car. More specifically today, I will focus on the apples. First what I will do, I will present the child the apple and hand it over to the student. The child will take the apple and feel it, look at it, as you remember this is a child with visual impairment, smell it if the, the item given to them have any aroma. More than likely sometimes they do tend to smell the item to see if there is anything related to it. So this child will familiarize herself with the item. I will present the word that represents the item as the child gets to know this item, whether it's the grapes or the car. I will show them this is a car. They will be able to look at it, inspect it, open it if the doors are able to open and really know this is a car and then really look at the words. We'll spell the words together. C-A-R for car. So this child can know this three letters represent car. So going back to the apple, after the child familiarizes herself with the words apple for the item apple, I will then present a picture of the item, whether it's the car or the bird. And the child will look at it, sees the word and the item and associate it. That also is the process of lear learning to read. Later, what I will do after the child understands and practice, practices to spell it, then I will just give them this card and ask them to read it to see and assess if this child remembers and connect the word to the item that was earlier presented. So I will ask this child to read it, spell it out, and see how the child does. After that, that will show me that this child is able to read this word without a, re a visual representation of the item. I will continue this routine throughout the objects that I have here displayed. Um, what I will do next, once this child has mastered the word, I will do, um, I will use assistive technology to teach this child so they can themselves go into the computer and familiarize themselves with the word and be able to type it besides just writing. That's another way to have them approach the word. Over here I have the picture of an apple. And this child will tell me apple, and I will ask the child to spell it to see if she can remember how to spell it by you looking at the words. Next, what I'll do, once I realize this child has mastered that level, I'll go into the next step and show it to them. Again, to reinforce their knowledge, the apple and the letters signifying the, le the, the item. Next, I will move just to the word, and the child will read the word. Once this child has shown an, um, a sufficient amount of knowledge and mastery this new word they have learned, what I will do, I will give the child a blank screen and wish this child will go ahead and type the word apple or the word bird or car, whichever it may be that the child is learning at that time, in order for me to assess if this child had mastered the word. So basically, I will be using items and connect them to word 
to teach children with visual impairment. I hope that you have enjoyed this presentation.